Let's play. It's the Phantom Safety Pin. Let's do Batman. Yay! Okay. This is the Flugelheim Museum, the third level of the game, and this is where the difficulty starts ramping up a little bit. This area is loaded with booby traps, so if you're not careful, you can get hit pretty hard and not even realize it. Uh, at this point in the movie, um, the Joker, Jack Napier, is now in existence. He has kidnapped Vicky Vale. He's pretty much torn the museum to shreds. Ouch. And he is planning a lot of bad stuff. So we have to go stop him. These axe dudes are really annoying. Uh, you really gotta get on them and hit them hard. Otherwise, they can do a lot of damage in a short time. Now, coming up here is a jump that I kind of find a little tough. But that's just me. So I save state here. Change the slot first. And then save state. Yeah, the F5 key on my keyboard does not work in the proper way uh, for the game. It, like, controls the brightness settings on my laptop. So I actually have to load it with... Load and save state with the menu. Sorry, guys. But there I actually made the jump. This jump, for some reason, is not so difficult for me. I don't know why I made it difficult for myself. Careful there, all those you get smashed by the chandelier. Now there's a trap coming up. You'll see a one-up guarded by a goon. Uh, don't go for it. It's a trap. Um, if you can get it, more power to you, but I've never been able to. It's very difficult to get to. Now if you're not careful, you can pull yourself up onto spike platforms. And I'm actually going to save state here because this part gets a little tough. Uh, I loaded state there because the last run of that area was a train wreck. So, here is this axe dude. Gotta get on him fast, otherwise he will rape your ass. Up there, there's a heart fill up. You really will probably want it at this point. Be careful when jumping down there, otherwise you'll fall on the spike to brick and hurt yourself. Don't know how I manage it, but I jump over this dude's axe here. Um, you really gotta be careful. Sometimes they will throw an axe before you're ready. And there's a guy coming up here that it does just that. I'm gonna save state again. Alright, loaded state because uh, the last attempt got me uh, messed up beyond belief. Now those chandeliers fall. If you're not careful, you can get yourself killed. You do need to trigger them first, so you gotta kind of do the edge under it routine and move out of the way. But they have a delayed reaction, so you're okay. This guy, I give him some flinch knockback damage so he doesn't hit me so much. I actually do pretty good with this guy here. If you're not careful, uh, he will throw an axe at you and launch you into the pit while you're jumping, and it will really, really suck. Now, also, these platforms get more and more underneath the chandeliers as you go, so you gotta be really, really careful, because, like, if it's your first time through, you can get completely murdered. I say stay here because there's another axe dude here, and his buddy up top, so he can get annoying. Now, that batarang symbol there is also a trap, so be careful. Up here, this is really where you can pull yourself against spiked platforms if you're not careful. And they will hurt you really bad, because Batman is only human after all. So, you gotta be kinda quick up here, and also pretty pretty careful. Up there, right there, that's a trap right there if you're not careful. If you jump while you're up too high. This guy, there's a lot of ways you can handle him. You can get behind him and sweep kick him, or you can air punch him from the platform. I usually just sweep kick him the batterings. Now, these guys can be kind of obnoxious if you're not careful. Ouch. Got up too early. Uh, those bad guys can respawn, but so do the batarang symbols. I think I just wind up batarang them. And I'm like, you know what, I'm low on batarang, so I went back and I got more. But I jumped down on a stake, so. Here's the dude. There's the rang. I am the Batman. Now this area, I have somewhat of a train wrecky time with, so apologize. Let me just uh, cut some of this out here. Okay. I think this is the one I make it. So, yeah, it, it can get difficult in this level. Like I said, the difficulty curve is being ramped up a little bit. You didn't expect the Joker to make it easy for you, did you? Come on, Batman, do it. Get up there. Woohoo! There we go. So I say I stay here. Nice pose, Batman. <laughs> He's like pointing his gun at the ceiling. There we go. 
His grappling gun, rather. Batman doesn't use guns. Because guns killed his parents. Parents are dead! Ow, I got shot. Now, here's where I have somewhat of a train wrecky time with it, so bear with me. I'm gonna cut this out. Okay, there we go. I actually just reloaded there because I kind of screwed up a bit. Um, and so we're gonna go down, collect some more batarangs. I actually collected these this time. Pull ourselves back up before we get shot. Be careful of those bullets, but there's a life power up in there. Now these guys can be douches if you're not careful. Um, they like to follow you into the room. So I try to deal with them before I get into the room. But this guy decided to go into the room again and follow me, so... And then shoot me, so I'm just like, you know what, screw you. For some reason, the baddies like to follow you into the room, so you gotta take care of them first. So I just threw a battering at him because he was pissing me off. I say I've stayed it here. Just because... This guy you really have to take care of with batarangs. He's really too fast and his sword swings are too powerful to do anything else with him. Yep, now we're here with the Joker and Vicky Vale and this next guy can be a bit of a pain as well. Uh, he's a wrestler dude. Gotta be close. I usually throw some batarangs out at him to weaken him a little. Careful with him. You get close enough to throw the radio, but you want to get out of the way when he does that not get hit by it. There we go. Here we go. Now, as I was saying, uh, he'll throw the radio. Now, you really want to be careful of that charge. It can do some nasty damage, but what you want to do is make sure he slams you and just get him in a loop like that and just hit him repeatedly when he gets up. Sometimes you can get a couple extra hits on him. I don't know how I did that. Careful, he likes to charge a lot. You want to get close to him, but that often entails getting hit. You can't throw batarangs at him when he's charging. It doesn't work. Oh god, that annoying loop of charging and charging and charging. This guy pissed me off a lot when I was fighting him the first time. Um, there we go. Ow! Come on, man. Throw me a bone. I probably just get pissed off and throw batarangs at him. And now you get treated to a really cool cutscene. Like in the film. I was like, what the hell? Gotham City Street. Alright. This is the badass level. You're going to see me safe stating a lot here and uh, reloading. Because this level gets tough. For some reason, this is the toughest driving level. And it's super long. Now, your enemies here mainly are like Joker mobiles and cars. Oops, I missed a heart up there. but So I'm going to go back and grab it. Now, I shouldn't have to load state in this freaking level. I don't know why I am, but here we go. Do, 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 do. I love the music in this level. Anyway. But now you see why I picked the uh, Genesis version of this game. Some kick-ass music. Better than the NES, in my opinion. Ow! I got hit my car there. You're allowed to be careful of those uh, Joker cars. As you can see, our batarangs have been changed into missiles now. So, uh... We can use them to hit the uh, other cars with. This main, this level mainly consists of you driving and shooting cars, tanks, and vans. Yes, there are tanks. I don't know where the Joker got tanks. That spread tank is too hard to hit, so it's best to just avoid it. That's that's what those missiles do. They spread out and they heat seek. Uh, except the Joker gets a few of his own in uh the flying level, the second vehicle stage, which comes later. That tank is the second type you'll see. Uh, it just shoots a single bullet. You can avoid it if you're careful, but it really it's just probably best to shoot it. That's the hard tank up there, but I for some reason find them pretty easy if you're careful. And I get shot there. Ow. Now I only have two lives of wish to do this, so I'm just like, you know what? You know what? I'm just, I'm just gonna save load state here. Because I had so many missiles, I didn't want to lose any more. So this is going to take longer than it should necessarily take. I, I really should not be taking this long, guys. I apologize. And just This is kind of actually a, a rough game if you've never played a Genesis game before. It's a hard game to get started on. I mean, it's not something simple like Sonic. I mean, come on. Sonic is easy. Pause. And then I save state here because I don't want to go back. So yeah, there is gratuitous save state abuse in here. 
It's because I really can't think of what else to do. I'm sorry. Like I said, action... Now, action games really are not my thing. I'm usually not that good at them. Usually... And I'm used, unfortunately, to the modern conveniences of putting hearts pretty much everywhere. This is a hard difficulty setting for me. And this is the normal difficulty. I did not put it on hard. Dude, let's shoot the Joker's cars. I don't know why. I just, I love the music in this game. I'm so sorry. It's just such awesome music. Now this tank, you have to get in the line of fire to shoot. I would recommend being careful with them, trying to stay out of their line of fire if at all possible. There's a spread tank coming up, and he's pretty tough to avoid if you're trying to avoid all those tanks. Oh no, wait, sorry, that's not the part. My bad. <laughs> oh wait, no, wait, that is that part. That is the part. Like, there's a spread tank right there. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not thinking straight today. Maybe that's why I will never be the world's greatest detective. That is why I am not Batman. Doo 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 doo. It's okay, because I'm a rogues girl anyway. There's another one of those uh, single shot tanks. They're not too hard. Just don't get hit by them. Another one of those tanks. I try to avoid them here, but it winds up being like a train wreck, because you really don't want to avoid that top one. You really want to get through them. So you can get... And then finally, I'm, I'm just so close to the end, I'm just like, you know what, never mind. I'm just going to go with it. It only takes five missiles to destroy the other dude anyway. Oh, those spread tanks are difficult. That's, that's the hard, hard tank. And it spreads out across the whole screen. Do not get hit by those. You can pretty much just avoid the Joker cards if you're careful. Doesn't take too much effort. More batarangs! Missile bat rang things. Missiles. More missiles! Missile rangs, as someone said in their LP of this game. I believe it was like Solaris something or other. He did a much better LP of this than I did. Pretty much got hit like very few times. Died I think maybe once in the entire game. But it's probably because he's played the game a lot. And I have not. <laughs> This is a secondary playthrough, uh, so. Da 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 da, I really like this music. It's really cool, I really like it. You can avoid most of those tanks. But I was being really dumb. But I'm so close to the end, I just don't want to back out now. Ow! Oops. Yeah, uh, I died there, so I just loaded state. So you're gonna see this again, sorry. But, it's not too far back. You get these three guys, a bunch of Joker van cars. A bunch of cars owned by the Joker. He is a bad dude, we're gonna go kill him now. The best way to take care of those tanks right there with the single bullets is just to hit him with a single shot. Uh, these tanks right here with the fast guns, just avoid them, it's easier that way. Another one of those uh, arcing ones. More Joker mobiles. Just keep going. Another spread tank gun thing. It gives you a specific start point. So, uh, if you fail, it just goes back to that start point. But that area there, that was a second checkpoint. It would just put, it, put me at the start of the checkpoint. Oops, I missed those missiles. Oh well. You can hit them with the bullets, but I don't recommend it. It's much more difficult. And you can hit those spread tanks, I just tend to avoid them, it's easier. Rather, they're not spread tanks, why do I keep calling them spread tanks? They're fast tanks. I pause here in safe state because I am not about to do that whole area again. Again, I'm so sorry I'm safe stating on an easy little portion of the game. I don't know why, guys. Ow. Spread tanks. Spread tanks are not my friend. I thought for a second the level was going to end, I'm like, oh. Huh? Already? Ow! I ran into that dude. Got some batarangs there. Careful of those, uh, bombs that the vans throw. I think we're just about to the boss anyway. Ow. Do, do, do. So anyway, I, yeah. I flub up a lot in this one. I don't know why I made this so much, so difficult for myself. It's really not that hard. But, you can keep going, trucking along, 
shooting some bad guys with my guns on my epic car. Oh yeah, because I am Batman and I like to make sure bad guys are to uh, to justice. Cause my parents are dead. You kill my parents and I'm gonna get my revenge. Oh, I was singing. Oh well. No, I will defeat you, Jack Napier. I mean the Joker. I mean Clem Rusty. I mean Mr. J. I mean. You see what this game does to me? Makes you think I actually am Batman. Ow. I tried avoiding them here. Tried a different stat strategy because I got a little stuck on this area. <laughs> you can hear me hammering the keys. Wow. Keep trying. But, ow! I keep trying, but damn it, they're just too fast for me! I am only one man! And his car, and his fisticuffs, and his boy wonder, well actually not in this game. There's no Robin in this game. Oh, these ones get annoying. Ow! I just, I, I think I just decided to screw it at this point. Or maybe not. Yeah, I just go, you know what, screw it at this point, and I save the state. Because I don't want to go back again and try again. Ow. But we're close to the boss by this point. I'm sorry, I'm usually not this bad at racing games. Like, racing level areas. Usually I'm pretty good at it. I don't know how that bullet didn't hit me, but it did, didn't. did Like, see, it should have hit me, but it didn't. Spread tank! Nasty little surprise there. Load state. Yeah, that would have brought me to the next area, but I would only have had one life to take out the the mega tank with. So you gotta be careful. Like here, you get three spread tanks, one after the other, I think. Yeah, three right after the other, and then I think you get the mega tank in like five seconds. Nope, you get a spread tank first. My bad. And then I save state here because I'm like at the boss. And here comes the boss, but it's okay because he's actually kind of a pushover. Well, another spread tank first. Ow! I just like, screw it, I'm at the boss. Oh wait, no I don't. No I don't, no I don't. Come on, have some missiles. They are your friends. Oh wow, it went off screen. And here is the big guy. Here is the uh, mega tank, the Joker tank. You gotta be careful with the bullets, because if you're not careful, they will kill you. I actually let myself die there because he's up. His enemy does. The enemy's life does not come back. Uh. But I can't get hit again. So you kind of have. To, I kind of have to do this in two lives. I only have two. And not get hit by those in the process. <laughs> and here comes the mega tank again. Now usually all you have to do is stay on the bottom in the bottom lane to avoid the spread guns. And just feed it feed it missiles. It takes only five missiles to take this guy down. And if you run out of missiles, just use the cannons. It takes longer, but it's not too tough. There we go. And that is Enough to bring us back to the Gotham streets as taken over by the Joker with his mongoons. But that's for next time. This is the Phantom Safety Pin. See you later.